30 minutes and then right. just an interview with Birdie after. Oh, um, okay. Just put the camera in the back. Is that alright? Yeah, yeah, it's a good stuff. Because it's like, it's kind of sports. It's like, it's probably out to like get sick. Still waiting on a decision from the ref and uh, obviously just preparing like we would, um, just expecting it to be on. Christmas, maybe you could get it kind of blown up and put on the canvas so you can stick it in his manager's office. Would have liked to have picked up a few more wins, but look, we're on a good run and I think most importantly, we're playing well as well. There's, there's been some good performances, um, even sometimes when we've lost, we've, we've performed well. A huge result and a good performance um, that um, obviously took us away from the drop zone. And obviously, going back there now is. Uh, we, if we can repeat something like that, it'd be it'd be great to be the right winger um, or the left winger. So, yeah, look, it's it's never easy, but you want to test yourselves against the best. And... As Palace was his fiftieth in the Premier League. That's some achievement. Yeah, I don't I don't think people realise how how big an achievement that really is. I, I know how good he is, and when he gets on runs, it can it can be unstoppable. Talking about uh, Chris Wood, they are big games against teams that are, are sort of in and around us. Well, especially Newcastle, so. Yeah, look, um, if we can get a couple of wins, that'd be fantastic. Do you want to get us underwear, please? Uh, you're looking a bit overdressed there, Sean. Overdressed? Yeah. Are we really going to make a story out of the fact that I had a shirt? And are we really, is that the best we can do today? Come on, let's, let's have something real, come on. What about training inside? Uh, <laughs> what about it? Well, there's a fair chance that it's the same team that we were going to put out because we like the team that we thought we were going to go out and play. Um, we've got to monitor injuries or possible injuries today, and you know, it causes only really the fact everyone's up for it. You know, we're up for it, the players are up for it, you get up for it mentally, physically, uh, all the emotions that happen pre game, the fans as well, even though that's not our domain, we agreed and we talked about that with the referees. were horrendous around everywhere, around Burnley, worst I've seen since I've been there, rising rights, safety of fans, safety of the players. Etc. Etc. So all of that got approached by the managers, the referee, and the people from the Premier League. The most technically gifted squad that he's, he's or that he's been involved with since he's got, he got into the first team. Would you would you go on? No, disappointed really. They got called off. You know, obviously once you're there, um, you're ready to play. You've done your preparation through the week. Um, so, yeah, it was, like I said before, a bit disappointing that he got called up, but obviously it was for, for safety reasons, so you know, getting points on the board is obviously a massive massive thing for us. We, we were playing alright at the start of the season, but you know, we just wasn't getting the, the results that we needed, so we worked hard, as we always do, and you know, it looks like he's, he's turned the corner now, but it's, it's up to us to keep it going. Yeah. Oh, yeah. We've got a camera there to film yes. this, yeah? Yeah, yeah we've got a camera. Recording this. Yeah. 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 Hi, Josh. How you doing, there? Yeah, I'm good. Thanks. Ooh. How are you? Yeah, I'm okay. Thank you. Uh, I'll just, uh, I'll just start now. I'll just knock us. I'll just knock us in. Just so. Are we okay in there in terms of the camera? It's quite disappointing. They got called off. For like, you know, fair play for everybody at the club as well. They. Um, like looking out on the pitch and the amount of like staff that were, were trying to help I think even the chairman was out there and, and digging and stuff so they did uh, did all they they could do to try and get the game on but um, that must have been almost like to, to your youth team career you know when games used to get called off like an hour before the game and stuff like that and you were all to go it was a bit of a was that a bit of a sort of strange experience? Mm -hmm. Sort of like say, reminds you of the youth team days where you turn up and it just throws over and there's not much you can do and you go home and and stuff. But um, yeah, like I say, you know, we we seen everybody do the best they could and you know I think they they had all the stuff prepared. What, what is um what's it like to play under Sean? Because obviously been at Burnley for, for a long time now he's got the new contract and the way that you watch the way that Burnley play and what he sort of expects but then you come here and you know it's exactly what what you see is, is what you get you know he's he's been brilliant for us to sort of work hard and every sort of the, the values that, that I believe in that you know same with him it's hard working it, it, it's humble instead of having three games in a week we'll have 
two games this week and you know whenever that game gets rescheduled we'll, we'll deal with that then but you know we'll focus on this game tomorrow um, and you know we're all going to be fresh and ready for that especially after the Brentford, Brentford game, fantastic point. And, and yeah, Wolves as well is a difficult team. I think they're sixth, sixth in the league. To get a point there is, is a positive, uh, positive thing, but we didn't play our best game, but we still came away with a point. What, what you want to do, uh, but then again, uh, if we are getting points, if we are winning, winning games. As midfielders, we want to contribute a bit more in the attacking phase, but we are, we are doing a lot of defensive work as well. So it's just finding that balance, as I talked about before. Brilliant. Good luck. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. All good. As Cheers. easy as that. Yeah. Perfect. Got nice and chat with him about general stuff but not even, no, never really around and playing squad the, the, the staff he's working with or introduced to um, I believe that's kind of I get the feel from what's been reported there's a best mix of what your belief is and what you can do and then what the belief is and what the players can do and I, I think all managers go through that as we did last night um, you know two players went in did very well but we're still missing two important players you know proved that I've beaten them five as well so does that keep them out of I don't think we lack morale. Um, I think we know we can compete. We know we've been competitive in previous seasons, and we have been this season. You know, I will remind you that the stats for quality of chance has been good. Uh, other stats of what we do. Um, so there's been a lot of things that are, are very close to being right. 